Hello, ladies. Getting ready to do the second kettlebell workout. Um, this will be a pretty much a full body weight workout, uh, focusing on the core and legs and a little bit of chest. Um, it will be a high energy workout. We would be doing six different exercises for uh, 50 second intervals with uh, about 10 seconds of rest in between each one. The exercises we will be doing is as follows. As always, we will start off with a two minute warm up. Then we'll get into 50 seconds of kettlebell swings, 50 seconds of reverse lunges, 50 seconds of squat hold and a chest press. 50 seconds of lat rows, 50 seconds of kettlebell um, deadlift into a jump, and then we'll be doing some side lunges. All of these will be done with a kettlebell, holding a kettlebell. 50 seconds of work, followed by 10 seconds of rest intervals. So remember, we need to get a two minute warm up before we begin and as you can tell by what I've just told you the entire work workout will only take about 10 minutes God bless you guys and uh, make sure that you have water make sure you get a good warm up we'll get moving and get you a uh, I'm gonna do mine with a 15 pound kettlebell but uh, just remember it's based on your fitness level so if a 5 pound kettlebell is enough for you use a 5 pound kettlebell if some of these movements you can't do any uh, weighted kettlebell at all, then don't use a kettlebell. If you find you if you find you have to drop a kettlebell uh, partway through a particular exercise, then go ahead and do that. Remember, do what you can do, but keep your focus on your form. Go ahead and walk in place. Get that heart rate up. Start my timer. Some arm struggles. Thumbs down. You can also do kettlebell swing with just your hands. It's a good warm up. Take your hands and clasp them together. Yes, yeah, sweetie, it is. Thank you. My, uh, my daughter interrupted us, but it was for a good thing. She gave me something that I was looking for earlier. Remember, these workouts are bring, being brought to you in real time. It's kind of, that kind of sounded like a commercial, didn't it? Well, it's not a commercial. Just uh, telling you that this, uh, this workout isn't polished. This workout isn't perfect. Workout isn't edited. I'm not perfect, you know, and I hope you guys aren't perfect either, because if you're perfect or try to be perfect, I think you tend to be a little bit too hard on yourself. Let's do some side kicks. Maybe there will be a day that I do edit my workouts, but right now that day's not here. Remember guys, getting ready to announce a contest. Our first contest with the real prizes. Hope and Fitness for Busy Divas is going to grow, but if it's not, I'm dedicated to you guys, the ones that want help on your fitness journey. We've got 10 seconds left, and we're going to get right into the work. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's get this kettlebell swings going. Well, actually, yeah, sorry. Get this kettlebell swings going. Make sure you're getting a lot of pop from the hips and the glutes. 50 seconds, guys. Come on, I know you can do it. This tire workout will focus a lot on that core. All these kettlebell workouts, good thing about them is the emphasis 
that we put on the core. That and they're short. Short and intense. Go ahead and give me a 10 second rest. Walk in place, jog in place. Reverse lunges. I tend to like reverse lunges better than forward lunges. Once again, to stay balanced, keep that weight right in the middle. Head up. Go straight ahead. Concentrate on each movement. Remember, if you have to put your kettlebell down, or if you can't do this exercise with the kettlebell, that's all right. Do what you can do to get better. Remember guys, you don't even have to necessarily do these workouts. I just want 30 minutes of exercise daily, and I'm hoping this will help you get there. Okay, 10 seconds of rest. Give me a real quick drink of water. Uh, go into squat holds. Squat position. This is difficult. I might have to drop my kettlebell for this one. Hold in the squat position. Slow it down. Make sure you're breathing. Not an easy movement. That's okay, we're gonna do what we can do. Feel that chest come alive. Squeeze it, come on. 15 seconds, guys. If you've had to drop your kettlebell, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna drop it to show you. Just keep moving. Three. Okay, rest. I'm going to adjust my camera angle. Okay, lat rows. Remember, guys, we're. I'm sorry, you might not know what a lat is. It's a big muscle in the upper part of your back. Remember, not to round your back. To keep it strong and flat. Wow, guys, I'm sweating on this one. Might be because it's humid outside. Might be because this is a high energy. A lot of, a lot of variables go in when you're doing an exercise or a workout. I'm gonna adjust the camera angle again. the jump. Remember, if all you can do is get up on your toes, do that. I'm going to give just a little bit of a hop. Remember guys, if you're doing this, when you land, your toes should be like shock absorbers. And when you go down and do the deadlift portion, Keep your weight in your heels. Make it one movement. Make sure you're breathing. Okay, now, walk or jog in place. We almost got this, guys. Sorry, my cam ring was a little off. Again. Side lunges. Alternate hands with the feet you're going to. Remember once again, to keep the weight in your heels. Switch hands every time. 
15 seconds, guys. Come on. You can really feel this in the groin muscles. Once again, though, those are posture muscles. 10 seconds of jogging. Two minutes of cool down, guys. Sorry, ladies, that my, I don't know why, but I was having trouble with my camera angle, but I think you could see most of the movements that I was doing. You just always couldn't see my face. You guys did great. I'm sure you did. But remember, guys, contest is coming up. And it will be announced soon. Minute and a half left. Let's just walk around. Cover your heart rate. Um, I'm probably going to do a video soon of some good stretches that we can do. You know, I haven't really gone into any stretches. Next week's workout might just be a... Uh, 10 minute stretch stretch or mobility work. I, I prefer to call it mobility work over stretching. And uh, in that video, I'll explain why. Ladies are doing great. Just cover that, recover that ticker there. Slow that ticker down. Well, hopefully you guys watch this video Either do this video or allow it, allow it to inspire you to get 30 minutes of physical activity daily. That's all I'm after. This is Ralphie signing off. I've got about 15 seconds left of cool down. God bless you guys. And I'm proud of each and every one of you.